All right. Uh, welcome to Choice Better of Me. And um, my name is Taisha, and uh, I know you know me. I have different uh, products, and uh, I've uh, my own independent uh, business outside of this. And uh, I'm also a nurse, and I. Uh, I, you know, I touch and go on a lot of different freelancing things that I do, okay? Now, with that being said, um, I'm going to be doing more things to align myself with the energies, and I feel that this is an excellent time to get back into uh, reading, okay? So, um, for the next month or so, you'll have me here because... Um, this is one of my outlets, and um, I'm definitely into my channel development, even though I don't have that much time to do it, okay? So, um, let's get into your reading for the 4th to the 7th, all right. Um, now, in this time period, I need you to um, rock with me, okay? Is it's just off the cuff, but I know that um, I have like a, a fan base. It's pretty strong. Um, my blog, First Saturday of the Week, New York. Um, I know a lot of people follow my blog, so um, I mean, honestly, no matter what I do to keep them out of there, they will find a way to get up in me. So they always will really surprise me. Whatever, that's their own problem. At the end of the day, we're just trying to, like, live, right? All right. So, between the 4th and the 7th, you are going to be coming out of your head, okay? For air sign energy, which is like a Aquarius, Libra, a Gemini, individual. They're going to come out the head because they're going to miss an opportunity at this time. Because they're going to be too busy doing what they need to do, which is good because you need them to do exactly what they need to do. Because the Queen of Cups, which is a Pisces Cancer Scorpio woman, this woman, if in your life, is going to be jealous as hell. We don't even know why she's going to be that goddamn jealous, but she's going to be that damn jealous. A Pisces is going to tell the truth. Or you can even be a Pisces. You really don't know at this time, but it's going to be required. You're going to love that. You're going to really love it. Okay? Now, I like to pick your brain. You know, people don't just follow people just because they're sheeps. You know, I don't really like to call the, my followers sheep. You know, I call them trip because they will rip you apart. If you ever read anything from me, you you are so up on ice game, everything, you should be able to handle yourself in any box I put you in, which is good because I like to see that my readers are actually like using it to advance themselves in life, which is great, right? So with that being said, you're not going to be enlightened that you're going to have strength for the situation, which is good because I need you to have strength for anything that's going to come towards you at this time. There's going to be people that's going to tell you that you don't know what you're doing, and they're going to be like, you don't know, um, you should stop doing whatever it is that you're doing, but if it's been working for you, you should continue and keep doing it, okay? At least that's the advice that I would give you, because it's something that I implement for myself, okay? Now, with that being said, you made a decision, which is good. There's nothing wrong with making that decision, all right? And when you make that decision, um, or a fire sign who makes a decision, it's not going to be a victory. That's not going to be a victory because a Libra, which I always call my law card, they're not going to come up right. And when Libra's upright, and I always say this, when Libra's upright, they are for everybody. But when Libra's in reverse, it just means that they are uh, whatever decision that they have made. They have, um, they decided to stick to it and pull over there. With that being said, you're going to feel like you're out in the cold. 
okay? But don't worry too much, okay? Because you're not going to be giving back a thing. You're not. You're not going to give back anything. Because you're going to be implementing um, from my blog, and you're going to be, you know, moving ahead slowly and slowly. And you're going to be safe because I try to keep all my readers safe, okay? And somebody's going to run up on you with a little bit of effed up truth at the same time, okay? Now, a king of pentacles. Now, this could be a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn man, all right? He's not going to come out today. He's not. He doesn't even realize how much I protect him. But I'm just going to sit there and pretend that he's of the right state of mind. Um, but with that being, you know, that information, you're going to check back in because you're going to realize that a scorpion energy, now you know my scorpion card, upright, is always wrong. They're in reverse right now. They're in reverse because they're going to be too busy in auto, auto, correct mode at this time. All right. And you're going to be moving through this situation with your higher self because I'm going to need you to do exactly that. Because you're not going to be wounded. Okay? Now, I don't know what you're getting yourself into, but you just dumped yourself into a three-party situation today. I am not for three parties. Some people like three parties. I'm not for three parties. But you just did exactly that. All right? And um, you're not going to be up in your head when you do this particular action. Or a brilliant man... It's not going to come up right. That this is my king of swords. It could be Aquarius, Gemini, or a Libra man, or a cutthroat speaking woman. This person is not going to come up right because they're going to be moving with their emperor energy, which is good because my whole thing with emperor energy or anyone that knows emperor energy, that's like a person that does really good live startup, they launch it, and it take off, this person is, um, gonna be, like, uh, doing what they need to do at this time, and, uh, Cancerian energy, or Cancer energy, is not gonna come up right, because they're not gonna be rocking with their black or white horses at this time, and they're gonna drop the weight, which is good, because you need them to Drop it. Okay? Now, you're not going to be doing nothing too crazy. Well, fire sign energy is not going to be doing anything too much. Now, that could be your Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy. These three, they're not going to be doing nothing too much because they're going to be in uh, what we call um, moving by any means necessary at this time. And that's going to be a wish fulfillment. You're going to love that stuff. Okay? That's going to be a wish fulfillment to you. Okay? Now, you know that winner takes all. You know, I coined that phrase. Right? I did. And Empress Energy is going to be too busy tap dancing on her ground. Yeah, because I'm the builder. I make it. I dream it. I see it. I, I'm the Empress. Alright? Privileged as well because I came a long way and I went through a lot of battles to, you know, crown myself, okay, and I hope that you will treat me as such when you do see me, okay, you're going to be working, that is probably very good news, because what that does for you is, it's going to take you places, but you're going to probably feel a little bit not stable, or fire sign energy is not going to feel stable with that information because the law is going to be too busy fighting for acceptance at this time. Well, they could fight all they want, but they need to, like, really, like, uh, you know, give me a break, you know? They want me, they don't want me to do what I need to do. They want me, but they don't want me to do I tell them that I'm for you, but you got to make me good enough to be there for you, all right? Because I want you to, for these next, for these next, Three days, four to the seven. I need you to start thinking like that. Like, you know, what would he do? What would he do? He would act. All right? We need to act. If 
okay? You need to take action, be action oriented, okay? And whatever is in the past, leave it in the past because the future is so much brighter, right? I agree. You agree? Okay. Now, with that being said, you're going to be walking away from a situation you've had no business in, okay? Leave it a three. Third party situation, get the hell out of there. No one knows why you was in it. Get the hell out of there. All right. And then you're gonna walk away from something that is requited, or you're gonna move with your heart, which is nuts. Because it was requited. Like there was real love here. Or a Leo energy is going to feel that kind of pain. They're gonna come up right because it's kinda of applied to them, but then at the same time. They're not going to feel too good because that's, it's, 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 with, with the heart, it ebbs and flows. So you really, I won't put a judgment on it at this time, okay? Now, your overall energy is you're not going to be wounded, okay? I don't want you to be, I wouldn't want anyone to be wounded at this time. It's just, you can't build with broken people. All right, and um, I always said to like um, people who know me for many years that the one who makes you cry is always the one that can make you feel better. Now I could be wrong, but in my cases, it's like they're the only one that could put the salve, throw the rosebud salve on it, you know, massage the ointment in it, and monitor it you understand and make sure that you're healing correctly so in that case here's some stuff okay now with that being said you're going to be in overdrive i don't really know what's going on but that's good news that's great news because you're going to run into a queen a sword energy and i call her the judge's mom she could be an aquarius gemini a libra woman She's going to be doing right by you today because they're going to have, a, when I say millions of options, whenever you run into this person, they're going to have a million options and they're going to stay with you. And that's good because you need to know that this person can do a whole bunch of different things, but they choose to always come back to you. Okay. Now, the Sag energy is not going to come up right. They're not. The Sag is not going to come up right because they're not going to be balanced with that information. I don't even know why they're not going to be balanced. They're going to be sitting on everything. No one knows why they're choosing to sit on everything because they're not going to give back no damn love. That's not my problem. Why are you not giving back love? Why are you not giving back love? Oh, because he made a decision. That's good. You should make decisions and stand firm on your decision. Okay? And a Queen of Wands is your Leo, a Sagittarius Queen. This, I, listen, I'm going to call it an energy because I don't want to offend. They're going to be jealous. They're going to be irate. They're not going to be acting right. No one doesn't even know why. It's going to be like one of those not a good communication, you know, it's not going to be good communication. No one knows why it's going to be like that. Because you took yourself off the clock. Because once I see Eight of Pentacles and it's in reverse, you took yourself off the clock. Normally you go 7 3, 11 7, 3, you know, 3 to 11. You are in shipwreck. When you stop or it comes up in reverse, you pause. You pause because you're not going nowhere. Which is good because I, I kind of like to have your attention. And that's good. I'm happy that I can keep it for this long. So thank you for staying with me. All right? Now, you're going to be too busy taking the words out of everyone's mouth. All right? I don't know why. Or an Aquarius energy is going to be too busy doing that, giving back, pouring out all the water that they always accumulate, which is good because they got it to give. But whatever you want is going to be a no because... You're going to be foolish as hell. And I don't even know why you're going to be foolish as hell. But you're going to be foolish as hell. And you're not going to hop up in your toolbox. No. You're not. Now, you know me. 
Yet when your ace of wands is in the verse, you're not. You're chilling. You're relaxing. Or you're putting yourself that's a Leo, a Sagittarius king. I guess he's sleep mode because he's going to be mad. I don't even know why he's going to be mad. You tell me why he's going to be mad. Why is he going to be mad? Because a Gemini energy is going to come out of heartbreak. Because they need to. They got to come out of heartbreak at some time. And they're going to come back. And they're going to give you some damn love. But they're going to be like, here's some love. And a single lady not going to be single. No one knows why. Everybody sees a single. It could be a man, too. They see this man or this woman, and they walk around like they single. And I don't even know what's going on, but they probably not. At least that's what the cause is saying, because they're going to be competitive. No one knows why they need to compete. But that's what's going to look like the cause today. And you're going to be checking out mentally with that information at this time, because... It's just not going to be a good discernment. I don't even know why. I don't even know why. I don't know why. Yeah. So, on these next couple of days, you're going to feel good. And you're going to be pondering a little more. And that's good. And I don't like to leave you like with that type of energy, but just know that I'm always happy when I when I come in, and I, I love to share.